Hello everyone and thanks for hanging out with me. Today, Polestar 2 Rakobi test. I'm in Straubing. I got this car very nicely from AHM, car rental in Freising, that's close to Munich. They have other cars, they have Model S, even the Raven, even the Performance. And they have a lot of Zoe's, Tweezy's and a few Polestar 2's. And this is the Polestar 2 Performance. I can drive today, 600 kilometers, and they lend it to me. It's very nice. So we'll do the Rokobi test here. I drove from Freising here, it was 120 kilometers or so. And do my Rokobi test now. I arrived with 28% or so. I'm already at 37. I'm charging with 93 kilowatt. 95, yeah, that's nice. Let's look at the car a bit. In white, it's the performance. You can see that on the on the brake calipers that are yellow and on the on the seat belts that are yellow. <laughs> and it has a stiffer suspension. The ride here was really nice. Power is amazing. 300 kilowatt, 400 horsepower. It drives very nicely. The steering is awesome way better than the XC40. Regen is the same, um, power is the same. Look, it's, it has summer tires on already. It's a bit cold, three degrees. It has 245, 40 R20 tires. Are oh, they everywhere? Yeah, 245 XL. R20, yeah, it's 20 inch wheels. Looks awesome, really looks awesome. Nice. Ah, and for the people who don't know what the record, oh, to see that, <laughs> for sure, a bit off, come on, go check it out. Hey, we will post a two here, look at that, 78 kilowatt hours, 300 kilowatt uh, motor, it's true, all wheel drive, 150 in the front, 100 in the back. And if you don't know what the Rokobi test is, I'll do around 60 kilometers, first at 90 kilometers an hour, GPS speed in 110, 130. And then I always start at exactly 50%. Then we see how much battery we use in percentage. And then I calculate what the range will be at that speed. Uh, then we see the consumption. Today it's a bit wet and it's a lot of traffic, so it won't be perfect. And then, uh, yes, and then we can see range consumption. And then we also a time how long it takes to drive and charge to the 50% back and then we'll see what the best speed is for this car to drive and it's most likely above the 130 so more 150 160 but i won't do that today i'm on my way i'm driving 94 which is gps speed 90. i reset my trip only done five kilometers and then we can also see how accurate the trip meter is because I know that the, the trip that I'm doing now is normally 59.9 kilometers um, I'm doing the 90 trip and there are of course a lot of trucks since it's not a Sunday so I'll have to pass a truck so I will have to speed up and stuff if there's cars behind me I cannot and it says this coolant systems requires a system <laughs> coolant system service required i broke the car yeah i have to click that away just started off the off the charging i don't know what software this car has if it still has uh, problems just turned around because it's a round trip and let's look at our stats 30 kilometers 202 watt hours per kilometer i had to overtake a few trucks it's just so busy and the trucks go around 90 so i passed them average speed looks good um, i got the error message with the coolant a few times but then it disappeared so hopefully the the live stream already looked it up could be air bubbles in the in the coolant system uh, do I have to go away? Come on, drive faster. He's going fast. He's nice. And 29 kilometers to the charger again. Google Maps rules. Heat is off. It's on low, but I have seat heating on and steering wheel heating. I have my head on. I have 
59.5, so 400 meters off, 194 watt hours per kilometer, 86 kilometers an hour average speed, took us 42 minutes. We arrived with 35%, so we used 15% to drive 60 kilometers and with 195 watt hours per kilometer. Uh, important thing, what I said in the, other, in the video too, look, I'm cold, <laughs> no, no heat. Um, I really had to pass so many trucks, so many, I'm sure 10, 15, and a lot of trucks. So I had to speed up and sometimes a car was coming in the back fast, so I had to speed up a bit more, but never I'm, I'm above 103, something like this. A few times I could pass with the 94 that I was set on the, on the cruise control. But it was a nice ride. Let's see how long it takes to the 50% charging. What charging speed do we get? 69 only. It's not a lot. Maybe it's because of the coolant problem. Come on. Charging speed is increasing a bit. 71 kilowatt. There we have it. 54 minutes. Let's do with, yeah, around that. Okay. And you can see, charged 12.4 kilowatt hours in 11 minutes. That's good. Let's do the next round with 110. I'm on my way again, now doing 114, GPS beat 110. I'm already at 48%. Um, I started at 50 as I should. Consumption so far is 216, but hello, only eight kilometers. Uh, we will see. And by the way, you can switch the view. You can have the assist uh, uh, in the middle or your map or the speed and this is way nicer than in the uh, Volvo XC40 the middle screen too it's very nice I like it it's, and it's a bit easier to drive now when I don't have to think about trucks but one truck already passed another truck and we had to slow down um, but that's how it is I already turned around. Let's look at our stats. 211 watt hours per kilometer. Average speed is 102. Well, I just turned around. Um, 20, uh, 31 kilometers back to the Georgia, and then we done our round. Sun is coming out a bit. Still seven degrees. Um, I had to slow down twice for a truck for a minute or so. It's okay. Stats. We have 208 watt hours per kilometer, 59.5 again, 101 kilometers an hour, 33%. What speed are we getting? Before it was 70. Come on. Not amazing. The battery was for sure hot. I drove fast on the way here, 80. And it was 100 kilowatt when I arrived here with 20 something. That's okay, look at that. That's good. 112 kilowatt. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, I put the specs, everything here again as usual. So good run. I had to slow down again for a few trucks. I would say four. That's just just how it is. You can't drive perfectly. That's just normal. Um, but it was okay. The stats were okay. I'm surprised that from 90 to 110, they already only have two percent less state of charge. Huh. That's very interesting. I didn't think that. The car looks beautiful. It's really beautiful. Yeah, so charge to 50% again. 
and then we do the 130 kilometers an hour test. But at 50%, we look how many kilowatt hours we charged and how long it took. Almost done. We're at 46 minutes, 49%. Yes, you can see before it was 54 minutes. So we're way faster. So you can drive way faster with this car because it charges so fast. Still at 84 kilowatt. And I'm pretty sure 130 will be even faster. And there we have 50 kilo, 50% 50 at around 47 minutes. That's okay. And we charged 13.3 kilowatt hours in 10 minutes. I'm now on the 130 kilometers an hour leg. I'm driving 134. So far, my consumption is 292. I've driven 14 and a half kilometers. Let's see. <laughs> heat is still off. Only seat heater and steering wheel heater is on. Still have the summer tires on. Um, do my 60 kilometers again. And then I charge a bit more. And then I bring the car back. I just turned around. What's our stats? 265 watt hours per kilometer, 116 kilometers an hour. It is our average speed. We are at 39%. Still 30 kilometers to go. This is half point. So I guess I will arrive with 28. And I still uh, I got the coolant error again. Service needed. At 130. Ooh. But it was it came in the corner. Oh, ah, yeah, this is the beeping when, when you have to take the steering over. And you really have to steer <laughs> a lot, so it stops. Look at our stats. Can't see. 258 watt hours per kilometer, 1111 kilometers at our uh, average speed. I'm arrived with 29%. That's good. The run was not amazing. I had to slow down so many times for passing trucks. Uh, that wasn't nice. You have to stop the, the camera. Camera is still rolling in there so you can see a bit of the road. Um, consumption was good, I think so. I mean, 29%. First 35, then 33, now 29. It's cool. Almost done. Still charging with 119 kilowatt. 39 minutes, it's very windy. And it's there's snow or rain in it. Ah, see, it went down to 75, so it does the moving around. Yeah, I can't do a full charging test with it, sadly. 50%, we charged 16.7 kilowatt hours uh, in 10 minutes, again 10 minutes, always 10 minutes, and it took us, I would say, 39 minutes, 39, let's say 39 and a half, that's pretty fast. Oh no, uh, I, I started this four minutes too late, so it's, it took uh, 43 minutes and a half, that's what it is. God, it's cold and windy, I will end the video now and then turn the heat on, finally. Oh, because ooh, it's cold. <laughs> There's sun here, but it's cold and windy. Oh, my hands are freezing. Thank you much for watching. Uh, I put all the specs now here, uh, the, the the stats in the in the in the in the end, and then comparison with other cars and everything. Um, thank you much for watching. Have a great day. Take care. Bye.